Hi everyone, Alex with you. In this video I will show you how to set up and find Autosave in 3ds Max. First, to configure them we must go to the Customize tab and find the Preferences item here. A window will open with a lot of tabs and a lot of settings. We are interested in the tab called Files. All files that participate in the work of 3ds Max are stored here. And here is the After Backup block. Ok, the Enable checkbox turns Autosave on or off. For example, if you don't need Autosaves, they load your system too much or something else, you can disable the checkbox. But in fact, there are simply situations when this checkbox is already turned off. And on the contrary, you need to turn it on. So, you can go here and activate it. Below, the number of backup files is how many files you will create. That is, it will create 10 files and when these 10 files are created, it will then override the first one and when it has overwritten, it will override the second, third, fourth. And so on again until it comes to be beginning again. Below, interval, in minutes. After that period of time, you will have after save. I currently have it set to 15 minutes, but most of the time I actually increase it a little, to at least 30 minutes. Because in 15 minutes I won't do anything so serious that I need to save, but in 30 minutes it's already something more serious. Below, here you can also call your after saves. Changing these all settings does not require restarting 3ds Max, so if you change something, just click OK and it will already work. Next, where to find after save? In order to find them, you need to open your computer window where your local drives are located. Here you will find a folder called Documents. Here we are looking for the 3 d Max you need. In my case, it is 3ds Max 2024. Let's go into it. There are some temporary files, backup files, scenes. We are interested in the After Backup folder. And your After Saves is sent here every 15 minutes. I already have one file here. I delete them from time to time if my projects are large and After Saving takes up a lot of space on the computer. But now, while recording the video, one after save was sent here. Files are also sent here if your 3ds Max crashes, for example due to crash error. Often Max makes a backup save and it will also be sent here. That's probably all. If the video is useful to you, subscribe to the channel, because it will only get more interesting.